Welcome to our lesson on sketching and recognizing horizontal and vertical graphs. So we're going to begin by sketching the graph of x equals 2. And we know that our coordinate pair is made up of an x and a y value. And for the equation x equals 2, this tells us the x value is always 2. Although the y value can change. So for instance here, y could be 0. This would be 2 across and 0 up, which would be here. We could have a different coordinate when x is 2, but y is now, for instance, 3, and this would be here. Or we could have a different coordinate when x is 2 and y is negative 1, and this would be here. And you can see that these three coordinates can be joined together by a straight line. So the equation x is equal to 2 is a vertical line that runs parallel to the y-axis and crosses through x equals 2. And for question two, when y is equal to one, well, again, we have a pair of x and a y value for our coordinate pair. But this time it is the x value which can change, but y must always be one. So for instance, x could be zero and y is one, which would be here. Or we could have when x is negative two and then y is one, which would be here. One more coordinate, we could have had four and one, which would be this point. And now you can see the coordinates joined together to make a horizontal line that runs parallel to the x-axis and passes through y is equal to 1. Do you want to try and sketch your graphs in questions 3 to 6? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So for question 3, we have x equals 0. So we have x is always 0 in any coordinate pair. So y could be 3, which would be here. We could have had 0 and negative 2. And we can join these two points together to make the straight line of x equals 0. And this line is vertical and runs along the y-axis. And for question 4, we have x equals 3, which is a vertical line passing through x equals 3 here. And for question 5, we have y is equal to 3, which is a black line here. And finally, for question 6, we have y is equal to negative 2. Okay, so now we can sketch the straight line graphs. Let's move on. So now we're going to find the equations of a graph that pass through two coordinate pairs. So for question 1, we have a coordinate 0, negative 1, which is here, and 0, 3, which is here. And you can see... This is a vertical line along the y-axis, so x is always equal to 0. Do you want to find the equation of a line that passes through these two coordinates and these two coordinates? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So for question 2, we have a coordinate negative 2 and 1, which is here, and negative 2 and negative 2, which is here. So we join these two coordinates together and we have the graph of the equation x is equal to negative 2. And finally for question 3, we have 3 negative 2 and 3, 3. So now we have the equation x is equal to 3. Okay, thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.